Hello and welcome to today's video. Today we are here and we are playing Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. And today we're doing six races, random tracks. Uh, oh, we could do random items. Let's really make this wild. This is all we got then, huh? Let's randomize again and again. I want to do all on and random. Oh boy. Just shells. <laughs> Wait, alright. Let's see. Let's pick what we want though. Alright, I think we do triple shells only just to make it more chaotic. Wherever that piranha planets can go away. That can be here. Coin. Oh, if we take out coin. That puts us in a little bit more of a chaos mode here. We'll put lightning, we'll take out the flower. Triple mushroom only. Triple banana only. Alright. So we do have six races on six random tracks. I have no idea what they are. Normally, we go into a Mario Kart video, typically spend from the DLC. Uh, that we go into with okay these are the you know four tracks we're doing in an episode I want to do six because I feel like we can get I did a burnout I haven't played Mario Kart since the last we done it oh boy someone's got a bullet bill in first place hello So this is again 150cc, only a few items that we selected were available. Yes! <laughs> oh my god, that was beautiful! That was beautiful. I would've got absolutely bodied by that, uh, that blue shell if I did not have that. Bullet Bill myself. Oh boy. I've had a Bullet Bill in Mario Kart in a while though. That was good. This is this is fun. I like the little, uh, you add a little more chaos when you take out some of the uh, items that maybe Neutralize the front a little bit here. Like, you know, up here at the front, you're gonna get a lot of coins and like single bananas. But I've gotten a star, a bullet bill, and a blue shell in like the top three. I inked myself. Hello, what the fuck? We got struck by lightning. Oh boy, that's good. That's good. That's good. Lightning strikes. Triple green shells. Great. <coughs> Why did I think that? That was. That was. Cool. Hello? What the fuck? What happened there? Alright, here we go. Tough the line. Easy dub for your boy. Five more matches. Sprite in a clear bottle is uh, interesting. I don't feel like Sprite to me anymore, unfortunately. Kind of ruined the vibe, guys. <laughs> nah, I mean, it's whatever. I don't really give a shit. If you're gonna... Whatever it does. Not pollute the water for some shit. That's cool. So this is one of the tracks from one of the DLCs, because I've only done this track like once I feel like. Yeah. 
I remember doing it back in like, I think it was on the like Game Boy? Yeah, because this is SNES track, so they used to be on the, uh, the Game Boy version as well as the, of course, the SNES version. So, I remember playing it on the Game Boy. Seeing that last, uh... I just blue shell myself, basically. That's lovely. Holy... I just got absolutely destroyed. Oh my god. I got, I got blue shelled to oblivion. Holy hell. that middle I would have been oh, I killed it I would have killed it please <laughs> there's three bullet bills in the map cross the line let's go another dub for your boy So, I think, I mean, I want to win all six, right? I think in reality, winning five, just seeing the chaos of some of these items, I and mean, I got triple blue shelled. So, like, you never know. So, then I think I can win six, but I'm, five seems like a realistic bet here. Back away from that. Gotta slam the brakes on a little bit there. Like that could have been problematic. That could have been problematic. So I'm in the lead, so I can't really do anything with any of these items that I got. Kind of the one issue about having all these random items is that I'm here in the lead. The so triple red shell and uh, blue shell aren't necessarily beneficial to me. Like, in all honesty, can't really do much with it. Well, we got a new one. Brilliant. Still got two stars. <laughs> oh my god. This is amazing. This is amazing. Like, you got random tracks, random, like, a little bit more mixed up items than normal. First time I made use of those mixed up items. So. That's cool. Because that came out in the last update. And I mean, I enjoy playing Mario Kart, don't get me wrong, but. Uh, Mario Kart's definitely a game that. You know, back in the day was something that I played like. A lot of Mario Kart Wii with my family in like 2008. And my parents don't really like playing the Switch one as much. Uh, I mean, we don't have all the controllers, so it's kind of annoying to use the little little controllers. So, I mean, I don't play the game as much as I used to, is what I'm getting at. 
before I would go to school, I would get up and play Mario Kart Wii in the morning. I would absolutely dominate online, like that type of thing. But, you know, when my gaming is limited to a lot of video making and just one and I playing together. Like, that's the thing. We'll play together and whatever we typically play, whether it be GTA, which is most of the time, or the occasional Minecraft or Overwatch 2 moments. Like, it's going to be one of those ones. So I don't really get to play Mario Kart. So I didn't really get to play that new, uh, new random items, but I'm definitely liking it. I think it's a cool, cool change that you can go in and kind of have a little bit more influence on the items that are used here. I'm trying to get that dude's mushroom and I just screenshot myself and stuff. Inked by the shy guy. Seen that was gonna happen. I got six green shells. Surprised I didn't get anybody with those, considering how chaotic that whole area is. See, a few races ago where I was saying that there's going to be a race that maybe I don't win. This one seems like it's been a little bit closer. Through this last lap, it's, I guess the gap picked up a little more, but it's not fun. Three bananas, not fun. Two mushrooms. Right. I kind of close. I really gapped him there at the end, but when I got blue shell, it was it was looking close. Uh, so that was race four. We won four out of four so far, which is what we go for in most episodes. But this morning quarter episode, of course, we're going for six out of six. N64 Rainbow Road, huh? We haven't really gotten as many of the new tracks I was hoping. I mean, we only got one out of five so far, but hopefully track six is a uh, one of the DLC tracks. That'd be kind of cool. Get red shell loser. Oh no! I thought I cleared that gap. That's unfortunate. Try to pass it. All right, getting blasted to me. I'm gonna pass it. See what happens. Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm up over here drifting, so you can't hit me with that blue shell. Sorry, dude.
And we are safe to the finish line. Let's go. I had to throw all those red shells. So that was the one that was the close to losing a race. God damn, I was in fifth going on to the third lap. 75 points ahead. Uh, I don't think I can get beat. 55. Second place is 55, so. Yeah, the highest they can get is 70. So we've already won. Ninja Hideaway. All right, this is the new track. This is on the first DLC. The first wave, I should say. The first DLC was technically back in like, I don't know, 2015. Whatever the, whatever the ones that were on the Wii U was when Mario, with Mario. When Nintendo first decided they were putting out DLCs, that's like one of the first games I ever remember them making. That was kind of wild. That's when you had the, the Legend of Zelda and the Animal Crossing. Of course, it's kind of in this game. Mario Kart Deluxe were kind of just like there from the beginning. Oh, and the the Mercedes uh, cars too. Those were all the DLC content. The Wii U days of this game. What are y'all doing? Chillin'. My guys, shit. Right. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not the biggest fan of this track. Different route this time. What the hell? I don't know what that was. I kind of like drifted into it. Alright, there we go. Cross the line. Six for six. I'll take it. Uh, I thought I could do it, but, I mean, again, the chaos in here is definitely ramped up. Uh, Rainbow Road definitely showed up the most. So, uh, that's that, though. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys in the next 